Today it's me and I'm going to be showing you how to make a lemon cake. <laughs> and that rhymes. <laughs> so, um, I have a recipe here. But this is a chocolate cake. But to make it healthier, I'm going to make a lemon cake. So I have all the ingredients here. So what you need is 100 grams of plain flour, uh, a lemon, sugar, um, baking powder, um, we need butter, milk, an egg, but I've, I've got two eggs, and one in case one of them break, um, a vanilla extract, and a pinch of salt, just a bit, because you don't want it to be, ah, oh, this is really disgusting if you add too much salt. So let's get going. So we need 100 grams of plain flour. Oh, but first of all, we do need to, uh, um, we have to do this. So, because we don't have muffin cases, and these are going to be muffins, and we need to um, just put them in. But we need some butter so to spread it so it won't stick. So I've got some butter here. I'm going to just do that to all of them. So it can have... Oh wait, this one's got a bit too much. So all I'm trying to do is just put some on, but then I'm going to spread it at the end. Or all of it will stick on. Okay. So now let's spread it. This one's spread, spread, spread. And this one, this thing, is a special one for oil and um, and butter for like spreading on the things. And I did one of I did a cake video before, but it was a coconut and orange cake. All right, so this is ready. I'm just gonna put this here. So the first thing is that I'm gonna put the butter here. The first thing is that we have to add flour, 100 grams, but I don't know how much that is. So I'm just going to add a bit, and if we need more, then it's fine. Because this thing makes 12 um, cakes, because there's like 12 of these things. Okay. Wait, let me take this out. Okay, so I'm going to pour some flour in. So, I put my flour in, so I kind of had to pause the video because I didn't know how much 100 grams would be. Um, so now we have to put the lemon in. So first we have to cut this lemon um, into half. So, I've just decided that the lemon has to be for the last thing, so I'm going to put um, some other stuff in. So now you have to put some sugar in. <laughs> Alright, so that's 140 grams of sugar. Wow. So I'm just going to pour in some sugar. 140 grams sounds like a lot of sugar, but I don't want to make it too sweet because last time we made a cake and it was too sweet. So I think that's enough because I don't want to be, uh, I don't want to be, if I try this cake, I don't want to be getting water the whole time. So that's sugar done. All right, so we need baking powder now. So let me just open this. Thing and put a bit of baking powder like last time I made the cake and with baking powder it tastes it's awful is that enough okay um now we need I got some water. I'm gonna get a knife to like take it out. Okay. 
Mmm. This is all melted because like <laughs> it always goes on the other side. Alright, so I'm gonna mix up. Oh my god, this is really really powdery. And I think I'm gonna add a tiny bit more of this. So I'm gonna pour some in my hand. Okay, I've added a bit too much. Let me just put some back. Okay, and if there's more, then we need to add later. Alright, so we mix, and then we have to add an egg. Oh, wait. Ew, it's all slimy and drippy. <laughs> okay, I gotta put this in the bin quickly. Let me add another egg. Oh wait, how many eggs? Just one egg. So now I'm going to mix. Okay. Alright, so I added another egg because it's a bit dry. So now I'm going to mix it and then add the um, milk. Okay, this is going to be like very weird. <laughs> okay, maybe because I haven't added any milk yet. <laughs> okay, so now we got to add some milk. <laughs> it looks a bit like scrambled eggs. <laughs> now, how much milk? Uh, 120 grams. Because, like, I don't like uh, it to be too sour. So, I'm going to just mix it now. Oh, wait, no. I think I should have it. I think at the end I should add a bit more sugar because I might have added a bit too much lemon. This batter looks really yummy. I think I'm gonna try it. So I'm gonna just change hands for a moment. Oh, right, now it's going together. Okay. Tiny, tiny, tiny bit more of this. Okay. Right, I think I'm gonna add a tiny bit more sugar or nah, maybe not all right I'm gonna just try this okay so the batter is all done so now just to make it yummy and scrammy we're gonna um, crumble some biscuits in but first we have to do one and a half spoons of vanilla extract Half now. All right. Now I'm gonna do whatever I want. <laughs> oh, maybe just crumble some biscuits. So I'm gonna take two of these yummy biscuits out. I'm gonna crumble it. Mmm. This is gonna be tasty. 
tasty. <laughs> so right now I'm gonna put it in here. So I'm just going to do that, and then I'm gonna wipe it all off until the cake butter thingy cases are full. cake batter because um this cake batter is really good because it has like a lot of creamy stuff that made it really really nice but first it looked like scrambled eggs it looked like scrambled eggs okay so i put all of the batter in the little muffin, muffin thing so now i'm gonna take it and put it into the oven Ugh. because I accidentally I did a bit too much I was going I was adding some but um but I accidentally added a bit too much on that first one and the uh, and it was so nice so yes you want it there ready all right guys so here are my muffins cupcake cakes um so I hope you guys enjoyed my video and I hope you, um, if you make them at home and try them, you have, you have to have an adult, if you're like little, you have to have an adult to supervise it because it's dangerous when you put it in the other ones and out. So I hope you enjoyed my video and I hope you like these muffins if you make them at home. And thank you guys so much for watching and also one thing, um, if you want, if they look a bit dry, then you can put some chocolate or jam or something on the top to make it not dry at all because like that's what I might do, I might put some chocolate on it. So yeah, thank you guys for watching, bye!